We've not lost any major election. We've done rerun election in Casina and we won twice. We did one on Saturday, we won again. We've had a rerun in um, Pauchi for Senate, we won. We did another rerun of uh, House of Rep last Saturday and again we won. But even more outstanding for, for, for me and for the All Progressive Congress, both the leadership and the membership, is the, is the humiliating defeat that uh, Senator Pukola Saraki suffered in the hands of Kwara people who are determined to dismantle the Saraki's... Uh, 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 I don't want to say Saraki's dynasty because we must respect his late father. Mm -hmm. Even though he is on record as having worked for the political downfall of his own father, mm -hmm. we are not going to talk about Saraki's dynasty. We want to talk about Bukola Saraki's failed attempt to install the sole variant of, a, of a, 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 a political culture in which he is only constant uh, a decimal. And I think the good people of Kwara State has dealt him a big blow. And consider he is the proclaimed leader of the opposition, the PDP, and he has had to leave to lead elections in Nushu and other places. Now here is a native doctor who was busy going to other states, now unable to heal his own uh, people in his own state. For us, that defeat in Kwara is most outstanding, particularly as it was affected to a candidate that was put in place. Uh, not by anybody close to Saraki, and he, he won. So for me, uh, remember the other day we achieved some little fireworks. I, I had rightly said that society is held together. There is peace and progress and development in a democracy, not only through the rule of law, but also through strong ethical commitment and strong normative values. And of course, complete adherence to the core values and principles of democracy, which is that majority rule. And so we are not going to accept a Nigeria variant where a minority party preside over the affairs of the National Assembly, whether as represented by Senator Bukola Saraki or as represented by uh, Honorable uh, Dugara. They just must vacate because it's not right. Now, for me, this was issue of principle. He then went on to say, Shumali should be, uh, I, should have no I have no moral right to talk about uh, politics. Now, in his own case, what the people of Kwara have done, other our party, is to not just to give, they will give him the honor of resigning. They are going to politically bury him uh, come February next year. And he has seen the first warning signal. They've done the first one meter grave. And by February next year, Senator Saraki will be politically retired by the great people of Kwara State who he has mismanaged uh, their political life, economy and society over the past several years. So I am very excited about that and we think that this is something worth celebrating and we took time to celebrate it today and uh, that is the kind of tonic you need in a moment like this. And the other significant point to be made